Mucho shaka paka. Mucho shaka paka. Mucho shaka paka. I'm here. Your wish? Sure. Achua penki, yun patisa. Di chuba jikutka naga, kingu mwa muli radwana. Kin ba nikcha lora kun. Chiwi aita ka chong chicha. Agi inko tune chuna muli ra. Tangi wama jiko na. Tong kit pa nonku nek abog. Tong hit wama aki inko tune. Potong hi wama ji aki inko tun. Tong pa no kun. Jiska no soki, kopa bono nakachu, labora na winki smak toma, kuyami juzku chita nai, uchua penki, 
topa na oto bon casa y uba pato kanchi ya tuka ulan chiwi aita ka chong chi cha agi inko tune chuna muli ra tangi wama jiko ichuta Na oto bokasa, papa ki muli ra kun kin. Chang wa ba chin yo, shang wi cha ma u cha wi shu yong kun. A chu a penki, yun patisa. Ti chu ba chi kot ka naga, kin bu mwa muli ra duana. Kin ba ni cha lo. Chiwi aita ka chong chi cha Agi inko tune chuna muli ra Tangi wama jiko na Tong ki pa nongku ne A chua penki Yun patisa Ti chuba jikot ka naga Kingu ka kin cha na wabaka on Bagwa shong koti mat Chiwi aita ka chong chi cha Agi inko tune chuna muli ra Tangi wama jiko na Tong ki pa nongku nek abog Tong hi wama agi inko tune O tong hi wama ji agi inko tun Tong pa no kun no nek Chiwi aita ka chong chi cha Ki muli ra kun kin Kin ba no kun nek Tong hi wama ji agi inko tun Ka chopa bog ra shong ko ta chi cha Un chawa wis kun yun kun Ogra shok chong kanti chopa chawa wis yun kun Jiska no soki kopa bono nakachu Labora na winki smak toma Kuyami juzku chita nai Uchua penki Topa na oto bon kasa Yuba bato kanchi Achua penki Yun patisa Tichuba jikota naga Kingu mwa mut Jiska no soki Kopa bono nakachu Labora na winki smak toma Kuyami juzku chita nae Tong hi tuwama aki inko tune O tong hi wama ji aki inko tun Tong pa no kun no nek Chiwi aita ka chong chicha Ki chiwi aita ka chong chicha Agi inko tune chuna muli ra Tong ki pa nongku Neka kang ki cha na Tupo Nuli ra slimo poi wanga Tong ki hak in inka tune Ki muli Tong ki tuwama agi inko tune Tong hi tuwama ji yuman ak in inka tune Chon muli muli ra tong pa akat in tutune Chin no muli ra ni bubo tong kin ba No ko neksag da hupa da tenya Ji chuta yun patisa Kin ba ni cha lora kun Ka kin cha na wabaka on Bagwa shong koti machit um
actual. Tong hit wama aki inkotune, o tong hit wama ji aki inkotun, tong pa no kun, no nek, chiwi aita ka chong chicha, ki muri ra kun kin, kin pa no kun nik gota, a tiska no soki, kopa bono nakachu, la bora na winki smak toma, kuyami jusku chita nai, uchu a penki muri ra kun. Kukumo no ba muli ra ti kun tong hit kun chunching ne boboje mata ne punage dulpi kikuana. Chi gratu lo da bograshi oni un kompa chin tono mutuba lo da ita kun ita patisa vatua kachatu tong. Bagra shakun tija ka um. Chuba kaha, chopa, chawa chuish, yunku. Jodo jid bunga rantang. Ka chikun ita hao donga. Ikin kuno ba mule ra chikun. Slimo podo na rundio dunga ku hunkabe. Jadi pada wana ni di bobo, tong nabung sya nunungnya, tong petugas mak tele. Ronda di 
ki hotonga kun honka bi. Wana kun bez ching palamule tonking ba nunotek. Tuk nin chatukun ne mule rabes. Chuta wonga kun moyana tong patuk. Hotonga kun honka bi. Bez ching palamule. Tonk Tongki ba non tontek selima wanga kun bikin. Tong hai tuam cici jum lumpa. Nita puai tiki tu. Dolpa da bongwaleo gandona cucut. Kaci cu ita dundoga. Yu malita kuto tun. Cila mula ne nitu bobo. Wanga kun bis jang ba mulera. has given us a, a vision like the one we shared on Dantooine did you see it? of course you must have the force is strong with us both Kashyyyk is a lush but simple and undeveloped world I would not have expected to find the alien technology of a star map here the Wookiees of Kashyyyk make their home high among the Rosha branches only the bravest warriors dare to descend into the forbidding depths of the forest if the star map is located far beneath us on the planet's surface, as our vision seems to suggest, it's unlikely the Wookiees even know of its existence. No doubt things will become more clear once we discover the star map's location. Yes, what's on your mind? You got it. Oh, 
Kasihan Elva Kuri Kukla Pandemo Elva Kuri Kukla Kasihan Kustakan Krik Siap Fale Kuri 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 No problem. Didn't work. What? Gotcha. Simple. Gotcha. Simple. Yes? ドパスにもキータカンキータンラキリコンキンバムリラボナジキンバノコミックスアボンキーウィアイタカチョンキチャアギンコトネチュナムリラタンギワマジコナトンキーパノコネックアボンアキュアペンキユンパティサ Ki-wi-ay-ta-ka-chong-ki-cha-agi-un-ko-tune-chuna-mo-li-ra-tang-i-dwa-ma-ji-ko-na-tong-ki-pa-nong-ku-nek-abog-ki-wa-ka-ay
Greetings to you. Something I can get for you? Kindly direct your inquiries to me. Matten is merely an indebted employee. His opinions don't amount to much. So, new spaces have come to Wild Kashyyyk. Please, look well upon the wares of Eli Gand. I live to serve your needs. Just be sure to pay cash. The interest on his loans will drain you like a diluvian fatworm on a hut's backside. First off, hearts are all backside. Secondly, I don't much like the comparison. No need to get personal. It's just business. Poor fellow. He's been waiting for his friends to return with my money for a standard month now. Ah, but you don't need to hear this. What can I get you? I don't concern myself with what goes on past this landing port. The walkies are very difficult to deal with. No business sense. You mean they don't tolerate cheats? No, I mean they don't respect the finer points of a good business plan. Give and take. That's why the Zerk Corporation simply takes. You'd have to take your question to the Zerka Corporation and the walkies themselves. I keep to myself. Of course. I'm here to serve. Of course. You're in a hurry. Hello again. Value. Enslave? I resent that. 
simply fair business. This man's fellows left without settling their debts, so he must make up the difference. I know, I know, it's standard trading rules. I just want to know where my crew went. I was only gone for two days. This isn't like them. Yes, very sad that they would abandon you, especially while you were doing me a favor and helping repair one of my freighters. Something about this whole situation stinks worse than an overcrowded Ronto stable. What kind of friends would just abandon a crewmate? You think you know someone and they turn out to be a cheat. Oh, not like you, Matt. You honor your deals. A word is a bond in trade. Oh, it isn't about the amount. After all, as a skilled mechanic, Matten is worth much more than what is owed, especially on this remote planet. Oh, you flatter me, Eli. I guess we're best buddies now. <clears throat> as I was saying, it's a matter of principle. I'm nothing if not honest in my dealings, and I demand the same. He'll be free to go when his friends turn up and the debt is paid. I honor my deals. Let no one say otherwise. Thanks, but no thanks. No offense, but there's no point in exchanging debt to Eli with debt to you. Besides, he is a hard worker. I'd prefer to keep him. See you soon, I hope. Always open. Hello again. Without you.
Welcome to Adia. I trust you will find our facilities pass inspection. Zerka Corporation is very efficient. I'm sorry, I don't understand Wookie speak. Shiri Wook, I think it's called. What did the Wookie say? Zerka Corporation calls the planet Adia, and no, I don't understand the language. The local Wookiee leader has made it so we don't need to. Wookiees are unable to speak basic, but for the last decade, the residents of all local villages have been trained to understand it. I understand he works very closely with Zerka Corporation. He wants his people to work well with us. It eases tensions. <coughs> what did he say? I don't usually have a translator I can ask. I just work here in the lab. With the taking of slaves. I'm just an employee. You'll have to take your... He's the voice for Zerka Corporation. I'm conducting experiments of indigenous plant life. There may be... That will take some time. And the Wookiee... He's welcome. Please, I must return to you. I'm sorry, but Director Janos will see to your questions. I must continue my work. I'm conducting experiments on, of course, fair. Runda di hotonga kun honka di. I do my job and keep my mouth shut. Maybe I can do some good if I stay out of people's way. Oh, you see that? Me, no, God. 
Our work here, our work here could be the local fauna is amazing. If I could isolate why the trees grow so big, it would be worth more than a thousand Wookiee slaves. Mission, is that you? It's me, Lena, remember? I was dating your brother back on Terrace. Lena? What are you doing here? Where's Griff? I'm just passing through. Griff and I broke up a few months after we left Terrace together. Probably for the best. Your brother can be charming, Mission, but he's bad news. Don't you start trashing my brother, you cantina rat. Take that back or I'll smack you so hard your head tails will pop off. Oh, Mission, what's wrong with you? Why are you acting this way?
you've got your facts a little backwards. Mission could have come with us if she wanted to. It was her choice to stay behind. You liar! Griff told me that you didn't want his little sister tagging along. That's why he had to leave me behind. Is that what the hut spawn told you? I wanted you to come with us, Mission. I even offered to pay for your ticket. Why not? I paid for everything else while I was with that freeloader. But he told me you didn't want to leave Terrace. I said we shouldn't even go then. But he said we'd come back and get you after we struck it rich on Tatooine. Just another one of his lies. No, you're the one who's lying. Griff wouldn't... He wouldn't try to leave me behind. Think about it. If Griff wasn't trying to ditch you, Mission, then why didn't he tell you where we were going? After we left Terrace, he told me looking after you was holding him back. Griff's always looking to blame other people for his own problems. That's why he abandoned you. He did the same thing to me, too. As soon as I ran out of money, he started blaming me for all of his problems. Like it's my fault his get-rich-quick schemes never work out. Still on Tatooine, as far as I know. Not that I really care anymore. And if Mission was smart, she'd forget about that no good con artist. But Griff is my brother. I, I just can't pretend he doesn't exist. If he was here to defend himself, Lena wouldn't be saying all this bad stuff about him. <sighs> hey, if you want to talk to Griff, go ahead. Last I heard, he was going to make a fortune working the Zerka Corp mines on Tatooine. But as far as I'm concerned, he's out of my life forever. Anyway, you table dancing, brother stealing, home wrecker. I guess that's my cue to leave then. I didn't mean to upset you, Mission. But one day you'll see I'm right about your brother. I only hope it's not too late by then. Hey, Big Z, we gotta do something about your breath. I didn't want to say anything, but it's bad. Worse than usual, which is hard to believe. In fact, now that I think about it, your breath has been pretty rancid ever since we rescued you from those Gamorrean slavers. What'd they feed you, buddy? Oh. I know how grouchy you get if you don't get your eight square meals a day. I'm amazed you didn't pass out from hunger. Ew! No wonder your breath is so bad, Big Z. Good morning. We'll have to pick you up a toothbrush to clean that stench out of your choppers. Okay, relax. No 
toothbrush. Sheesh. Just try and eat something else to cover up that smell, okay? Stay away from anything that's smart enough to lock you in a cage this time. <laughs> Hold here, Spacer. Zerka Corporation doesn't recommend traveling in wild Adean. Katarn attacks are especially bad right now. Wookiee hunters usually keep numbers down, but I think they leave certain areas infested, just hoping a Zerka guard will get killed. You're the Wookiee lover? Why don't you tell me about them? I'm sure you're real close friends. Keep your pet on a leash, or you'll be wearing him. I have no love for these animals. I've seen guards ripped to shreds. I don't talk to Wookiee lovers. Get rid of your rug, and maybe I won't have you shot. You are the... Keep your pet on... <laughs> Not anymore. Look, you want to know why the Wookiees are acting compliant? You go ask them. When they rip your head off, we'll fish it out of the Shadowlands and give it a proper burial. How about that? I won't stop you. But you leave this area at your own risk. We're here to protect the company, not you. Our stories didn't do it justice. This is incredible. I wish he was here to see this. He'd want to see this, you know?
this isn't good. Uh, I can't afford this. You think I can? Do you know what they get for a healthy one of those things? We'll work it out later. We've got company. What do you want, Spacer? I'm Patrol Captain Denno, and you're interrupting Zerka Corporation business. This Wookiee slave got a little rebellious. We had to put it down. <laughs> Careful now. That growl sounded pretty threatening. Keep your slave on its leash or we'll have another accident. Just shut up, you trigger-happy idiot. Oh, of course they don't. Why would you ask me that? You're doing some sort of snap inspection? You're trying to get me to admit to incompetence, aren't you? Not going to happen. I stand by my patrol. This Wookiee got out of hand and had to be put down. We'll find another easy enough. Is that a joke? Who do you think you are? You make some sense. I wonder what you know about what might happen here. I mean, I think we should petition for a transfer. The corporation will survive a fight here, but us frontline guards won't. If... if you say so, Captain. Yes, I say so. Move out. This place just isn't worth the trouble.
Big Z, don't take this the wrong way, but lately, I've noticed you're starting to look a little bit scruffy. Uh, 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 no, I'm not suggesting a bath. I know how well that went over last time. But your hair's getting all tangled, and uh, if you look close, you can see a few gray strands starting to poke through. Uh, uh, Don't worry, Big Z. It's nothing I can't fix. A little trim, a splash of coloring, and you'll be as good as new. Best looking Wookiee on the planet. Maybe a nice suit. <laughs> aren't into the whole clothing thing, but you could start a whole new trend. You'd be on the cutting edge. Okay, okay, sheesh. Try to offer some constructive criticism and this is the thanks I get? Let's move on. You can just stay naked and scruffy for all I care.
Lord Malak was most displeased when he learned you had escaped Terrace alive. He has promised a great reward to whoever destroys you. What?
I suppose we have little choice. We should proceed with caution, however.
can I help? Yes, I suppose I can understand your curiosity, given the bond that connects us. Very well. I'll tell you a bit about myself. I was found to be strong with the Force at a young age, as most Padawans are. ...to be trained. When I joined the Order, I left my family on Talravan, as all Padawans do. My family is still there, the last that I heard. I've had little contact with them, as it is discouraged. Relationships with family members are fraught with powerful emotions. Such extremes are to be avoided. Anger and hate are the worst, but even love can lead to folly. Emotional entanglements can be dangerous. They can impair rational thought. They can lead to outbursts of uncontrolled emotion. A Jedi must be above such things. Like all who join the Order, I have learned to embrace the life I've chosen. I had to let go of my attachments to my family. It can be a hard lesson to learn. I was not on good terms with all of my family, but I do remember missing my father terribly for a long time. I was not on good terms with my mother. I was only a little girl when I left, but I was old enough to resent her and the way she treated my father. She pushed my father into treasure hunting. I spent all my young life on ships, traveling from one false lead to the next. She whittled away my father's entire fortune, and I hated her for it. I think she was relieved to give me to the Jedi, but my father was heartbroken. A child is too young to understand the sacrifices that must be made. It's better if they have no contact with their family once they're removed. Once I was older, I realized the wisdom of this policy. A Jedi must do what is needed, personal desires notwithstanding. Love can only obscure and confuse the matter.
Even a Jedi cannot always control the feelings of the heart. We must do our best to guard against it, no matter what the cost. But some sacrifices are harder than others. I, I do not wish to discuss this anymore. I would rather return to our mission. You cannot win. The payoff from research is too much of a risk for Zerka to spend much money on it. Slaves are proven commodities.
I have to give you credit. You've led me on quite a chase. But nobody gets away from Kalo Nord in the end. You got lucky on Terrace. The Sith attack saved you from a quick and gruesome death. But I promise you, the Sith won't be getting in my way this time. Sorry, I'm not in this for the credits. You're the only ones who've ever gotten away from me. You got a rep to protect. Let's go, boys. Showtime.
What can I do? Yes? Follow me to my camp. Ah, don't start fawning just yet. I'm too old for it. Uh, I, I know a few things, but we can talk about it at my camp. Keep close. It's nearby under the law. Yeah. Uh, I, I fought the Sith. Now... What can I do? Yes? Welcome to my home. Pull up a stump to be comfortable. No, don't have neither a Jedi nor your master. Been lost in the woods. For my days of glory are behind me. Must have questions. Now, why would you be asking about that? Hmm? I knew that had to be why you were here. The problems of a few Wookiees don't amount to anything before the concerns of the Jedi. No, you are here for the map. Kashyyyk is an interesting place, more so than anyone suspects. If Circa Corporation knew, the planet would be a straight line. The Wookiees have their legends that they were not always here, but it is more than that. The trees themselves are strangers. 
What I'm saying is that there are literally walls to play, and you won't find what you need without my help. And my help has a price. You must do it fast for me, and then allow me to board with you. I will then remove certain barriers in your path. But I'm old and entitled to work you around a bit. Besides, the test is simple. Since they began expanding in the Shadowlands, the Circa have left me alone for the most part. Until recently, anyway. A group of them set up camp not far from here. Poachers is all they are. I like them removed from this place. They don't respect this place. They're butchering wildlife and threatening entire species. It's getting under my skin. The Wookiees could take care of themselves if they wished, but the animals are truly helpless victims. Oh please, this is arbitrary errand work. But such are the requests of the aged. I still have to leave. Their camp is in the far northeast. But remember, if I wanted them dead, I'd have done it myself. I'm a better way. Isn't that enough? I mean, I'm just sick of the truth. Perhaps your destiny might show me something new. You never know. They are not that far northeast of here. There's usually five in the area, as far as I can see. The captain of the lot is the one that earned my ire. Let's handle my guards, really. <laughs> What can I do? Another civil merchant, the docking ring? This is my deals, and I don't persuade easily. Mess with my profits, and I. A crazy old fool. I suppose he's still upset that we don't all. Looks like he chooses. I've got a job. You or that old coot can do about it. If 
know a fair bit already. What would I be? I'm on the ground, and I haven't seen anything like that around here. Deeper than this. The eastern forest could see. It's not worth it. You're fighting the plants as well as the animals. Passion vines are tough as metal and grow back fast. Instead, head office installed repulsor fields to keep the big predators out. Permanent placements, too. We'll be fine for years. If you made it this far, you know a fair bit already. What would I be able to tell you? What? No, oh, I don't do much. I'm in the business of harvesting animals. These have organs that can be removed. Talk to me about work and maybe it's my profits. Extra hand. A couple men have gone miss have to close up shop. We are hunting the tank. They have a gland when powdered. I figure I've got two or three wealthy years to butcher the lot of them. You want in before I make them extinct? Uh, no. I'll be rich by then, and we won't need to do it anymore. I don't have to worry about it. Besides, if there's no more tack, the predators that eat them will die off, and we'll have an easier time milking this planet. All right, then, I'll set you up. First, you need to be able to draw them out. It's easy. I'll spray you with this scent. It drives them crazy. They can't help but attack you, even if it's a hopeless fight. Then you just carve them up. There's a big fleshy bulb in their brains that you want to scoop out. You can't miss it. I'd feel guilty if the money weren't so good. Come back here when you've got the glands and I'll pay you. Good. I'm not down here to direct traffic. Hermit Jolie trying to talk you into doing his dirty work? We've spent too much on setting up just to walk away. As long as the sonic emitters keep the Preds away and I've got bodies to guard the perimeter, we're staying right here. I mean, if I can... I don't need this kind of garbage from you. Watch your mouth. I'm the only law there is down here. If you've got something to say, get on with it. Otherwise, leave me alone. I've credits to earn. All right, I'm done talking with you. You've got under my skin one too many times. I'll bury you down here. I don't make He's got no authority with me. He's just some pet we keep to the 
Uncles, you don't get in my way. You can wander when you want to do. That joke, as long as the... I mean, if I... Let's go. If you make besides you, predators that can kill in seconds, Bindo, he's got a camp here somewhere. No one who'd lived down here is just plain crazy. We've got a repulsive feel to the If you make it ain't easy. We've set up a perimeter of sonic emitters to keep the bigger preds away. It's worked. As long as the emitters are operational, we're pretty much safe. It makes harvesting a lot easier. If you Hurry. Good. Anything you'll have to talk to the commander. He's in charge of our harvest. Why am I here? I'm here because this is where the commander told me to stand. And that's all there is to it. I'm just a guard for this emitter. Why couldn't they have just equipped this lump of tech with a blaster and left me at home? I'm not here because I know. dangerous than walking out on the commander. He'd kill me for disobeying orders. I'm not here because I know stuff. I handle a blaster well enough to guard this emitter and that's it. Talk to the commander. They generate a sonic barrier that allows us to stay in this wonderful location. It keeps the big predators away. I don't know how it works, really. I just know that if they go down, the camp would be overrun. What of it? I don't like being here, that's for sure. I suppose you could take this code and shut down the emitter I'm guarding. Enough of those emitters go down, and the camp will have to move out. But I never said anything.
Sure. Anything you'll have to talk to the commander. He's in. Why am I here? I'm here because this. I'm just a guard for this emitter. My. What do you want to know about that? It's just one of five or so sonic emitters protecting the camp. I don't like being here, that's for sure. Enough. Oh. Ah! 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 Ah!
Motivators are in proportion. Ella, I don't get it. That merchant said there was salvage down here. We need Matten to work the sensors. Playback, playback. Eli, what are you... You got your money, you double-crossing snake. We had a deal. <laughs> playback. I don't get it. That merchant said there was salvage down here. Playback. When he gets back, we'll... Wait, I'm getting something. Oh, good, it's Eli. Maybe he'll point us in the right direction. Playback. Eli, what are you... Welcome back! I wonder, have you had much luck? Have you done as I asked? Yes, I could feel it as you walked near. And I don't sense the smell of death on you. You spared them. Interesting. Wasn't there? I suppose not, but the environment would say otherwise if it could talk. No matter.
Yes, yes, in the east past the poacher camp. I saw it when it was installed. It's a very effective barrier, but I am not even past it. And on the other side, ancient answers. And perhaps a Wookiee you are seeking. I hope you're in the mood for visitors.